Good afternoon, everyone. Um, there's a reason why you've got the me on the big screen thing today. Um, basically, we have reached a milestone. We've reached episode 50 of the Wraith Rovers say. So I just really want to say thank you to everyone for their support in this so far. Um, I had no expectations about my content creation journey. I, um, I, I started doing this because I knew it would be a fun way of me keeping me interested in playing the games that I play. So I really appreciate anybody that's watched from the beginning, or even if you haven't, even if you're a couple of episodes in, I really do appreciate it. I hope you're enjoying the save as much as I am. Um, please let me know in the comment section uh, if there's anything you want me to do. I am not the best when it comes to analysing tactics or anything like that. I just play the game how I would play it and if other people enjoy it, great. And if you don't, then I understand. But thank you from the bottom of my heart, uh, from the bottom of my heart sorry, for everyone that's that's been following me, supporting me. Re I really do appreciate it. And uh, in a second, we'll be back with the rest of the episode. But I just want to say thank you. All right. Right, enough of that mushy, mushy stuff. But no, jokes aside, thank you, honestly. All right, we've got the um, quarterfinal of the Scottish Cup draw now. So who we got? We've got Dundee or Inverness. So that is a winnable game against them too. You never know, we might make it to the final. Imagine how much money we'd make if we made it. To, I think we have made it to the Scottish Cup final before uh, in our Wraith Rovers journey. Past winners. No, we didn't. I'm, I stand corrected. Uh, in my head, for some reason, I thought we got to the final. I think it might have been the semi-final. So yeah, we're playing Dundee United in the next round. And we've got Celtic coming up now in the league. So, uh, no idea how we'll do against them. Probably not very well, but we've been playing well lately, so you never know. Currently fourth. Uh, let's have a look at the league table. Fourth, neck and neck with St Mirren on points. We could technically overtake Rangers today if we win and they lose. And then we'd only be two, no, one point behind Hearts if they lose. Obviously they win. Uh, but we have got two games ahead of Hearts. So we are doing well. But as you, as I said, anything can happen, and then also we 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 gotta just try and aim to get like in the top five so we can be in the uh what they call whatever they call is it called the the champions the championship playoffs or something like that I think that's what they're called if we can get into there at least we know that we're gonna get hopefully get European football All right Julio is not happy Julio whatever his name is. So hopefully we can get rid of him. Ah, oh, Rui's out for two of the rest of the season. Ah, oh, it's annoying. Such a shame. What injury is it again? Lower back stress fracture. Mm. I hope that doesn't have any long-term damage to him. Such a talented player. Already our captain. You never know. If I can keep him at the club for the whole of his career, which I highly doubt it, he might end up beating the uh, appearance record. Uh, let's have a look at our appearance club info. History. Records. Who's got the most... I don't, uh, 450 appearances. Right, so how many appearances has he got so far for us? 69, and he's only 19, so you never know. 10 years' time, maybe? We'll see. It depends if we keep him. He's so talented, I can see 
but unfortunately losing him to Rangers or Celtic or something or maybe a mid-table premiership team because of the minimum fee release clause Right, so this is our lineup. We've got Duris in goal, uh, Oyono, o o o o o o o o I can't pronounce his name. What's his first name? Anthony. We'll just go, oh, hold on. Onwa, there we go, we'll call him Onwa. That's his uh, surname. Onwa, Suta. no, I'm going to get this right. Oyono, Oyono. I don't know why that was so difficult for some reason. Um, but yeah, place this on the right. Pretty much standard. I'm just gonna move my leg. Sorry. Oh. Right. Let's see how we get on. I just realised Hoyland's got the number six number. That's a weird number for a strike as well. Right then. Let's see how we get on. I don't have any expectations against Celtic, other than, if we get a draw I'll be happy with that. <sighs> nice little uh, starter shot there. How is that not on target? They went to the keeper's hands. Oh, I don't know. Right, very quiet first half. We seem to be the better team though. For the stat, look at the stats. Is that a bit too fast? I feel like that's a bit too fast. Oh no, it's alright. Right, keeping possession here. See if we can do something with it though. Go on, Maldini. Diara. Don't lose the ball for God's sake. Hackney to Stewart. Stewart over the top to Campbell. Campbell across to Oyono. Campbell back to Oyono. Bit of 1 2 1 2. There we go. Oyono again. Will he cross it? Oh, beautiful pass. What a pass. Great strike by Maldini. 1 0. I'm not getting too excited because it's Celtic. So, uh, yeah. We just got to see how it goes. I mean, the fact that they played 25 games and that's 64 points just tells you everything you need to know, doesn't it? See, the Newton just scored then. Luckily, they were offside. Right, actually, I won't, I won't do anything yet. I'll just wait. There we go. Come on, let's defend this. Good save, goalie. We're doing very well. We're doing better than I thought we would. Coronez. Hackney. Across the Diara. Hackney now. Diara. Over the top to Stewart. Stewart. Crosses it in. Headers. Campbell. Shoots. Come on. Oh, I thought he was going to shoot them. Oh! <gasps> Palacios, look at that, a bit of South American skill there. We're actually bloody doing well here. I'm quietly confident we're going to win this game now. We are fourth, one point behind Rangers. Hopefully Rangers can uh, lose the game now. Right, we've got the ball back. Oyano. Floats the ball in. Oh, I thought that was going to be another one then. Right, Stuart's not... Oh, I don't know. Let's see who the assistant manager wants us. Yeah. Okay, Hackney needs to come off. He's tired. Uh...
hopefully not too many more tired legs out there. Stuart's tired. Put Vaughan on. Palacios. I can't take any more players off now. We've just got to hope for the best. But a great result for us. And we're third now. We've now knocked Rangers off uh, temporarily. We have got three games ahead of us, so... Uh, oh, we've got Rangers next. Oh, interesting. If we beat Rangers, that will help. Hopefully we can get a, a double header a, a win over the Glasgow teams in this episode. That'll be a good little episode. No, I know what the headline will be for the episode. It'll be like... Dominate Glasgow. Or to put Glasgow completed it, mate. There you go. That would be a good one. It's all about getting the right title for the, uh, the YouTube episode to encourage people to watch. We, we, we could be technically the favourites to win this, maybe. We got a new set piece coach, have we? Oh, he's terrible. He's terrible. What happened to our other one? We had a much better set piece coach than him. Have we got another one? Is it. Oh, get lost. I hate it when that happens. Uh, have we only got one or we got two? Oh, God, we've only got one. We'll replace. If I knew that, I'd just. Hide me own. Look at that, he's terrible. Can I release him? Probably not. Ugh. Right then. We got Duras in goal, Ayano was right back, Suter and Davis in defence, Longella was left back, Hackney and Campbell in the middle of the midfield, Bowler on the right wing, Deli Ali just behind Stewart. Maldini on the left. Let's see how we get on. Oh, we're second now. At the moment, if this game ends now. I'll be buzzing if we get second place. If we can consistently get second or, th second or third place for the next couple of years, while we build slowly. You know, the end goal is to win the Scottish Premiership, but it ain't going to happen for a while because Celtic are so dominant and so are Rangers. It's even more, it's even more annoying than the French League because the French League, the quality's there that you can overtake PSG eventually. I've managed to do it in a few saves in France, but the Scottish League is very difficult to win the Scottish Premiership unless you're Celtic or Rangers. Oh great, we're giving them a penalty. I think. Let's hope VAR comes to my rescue. Ah, oh, it doesn't. Right. Oh, I thought he was going to save that then. Okay, okay. It's not the end of the world. We have been playing well. We, we don't want to down our tools just yet. Oh, I pressed the wrong thing then. Oh, balls. That's had a complete opposite effect of what I wanted. Right. Demand more. There we go. We've been there. We've had more shots in there. Not necessarily on target, though. Go on, uh, see what we can do from this. Ah. Right, come on. Let's get this ball back. Yes, good tackle. Go on, Maldini. Longello. Oh, floats it up. Ah, oh, should have done better with that. What we could do, we get. I think a fair result would be a draw. To be honest, 
Uh, Ayano's knackered, so we'll have to put him on. I think because we haven't got any other right backs. Oh god, we've got a lot of players knackered here by the looks of it. Paris there as well, give him a debut. Quadruple substitution, that, hopefully that will help in some way. Uh, maybe not. Oh well, we're still fourth. Right, cross. Come on, let's see if we can get a draw out of this. Paris. Good tackle by them, annoyingly. Come on, let's get the ball back. Come on. There we go. Good defending. Come on, let's get the ball back. We've still got time. We can get an equaliser. Just get the ball. Come on. Get the ball. Ugh, this is annoying. Get the ball. They're just taking the mick at this point, aren't they? So, uh, Rangers, sorry. Good over the top ball. They're going to score. Yep. Yeah. Oh, well. Uh, it'd be nice to win back to back against uh, Celtic and Rangers. Yeah, fourth place now. Equal on the games with Hearts as well. That's annoying. Have we got Hearts coming up at any point? Hopefully we have. Right, we'll be back in a minute for the next part of the episode. Right, we're back for the second part of the episode. I decided to holiday the week, so we're just going to go through these before we go to our next game. I'm still uh, annoyed with that range of result. If I'd have lost to Celtic, I'd have probably not been that bothered because I was like, I think I just got too excited because we beat Celtic and I thought, oh, we might end up beating Rangers here. We signed a talented young striker who scored against us, Gary Forrest. So, uh, yeah, he's coming in. Um, potential to be a four and a half star. No, three and a half star. Maybe four star. We do this. I don't know. So, yeah, so uh, one for the future, definitely. We'll be looking to sign more players like him. Uh, yeah, Angel will be. Coming to us on loan in the summer. We had Oyono and Diara in the team of the week. Ineche, why is that? Oh, I don't even go. Ah, oh, Gary Rui might be in the uh, the next gen. That would be interesting. That would definitely probably guarantee that we won't be able to keep him. Oh, let's see how we get on. Aberdeen, Jesus Christ, another tough game. Then again, it's not the Aberdeen that we all remember. So we should be favourites to beat them, but then anything can happen. Uh, so the same defence and goalie, same midfield. Polo on the right, Maddie in the middle, Derig on the left. Pulling it up front. I'm hoping Hoyland will get a goal in this game. Yeah, our aim is to get fourth or third. I think we were very unrealistic. I think we were going to get second.
This won't be a penalty, everyone. I'm pretty sure. Yep. It was so outside the box, it was unreal. See how we get on. Oh, nearly. Bright start in the first half so far. Bit of a quiet first half though. We only had two. Oh, we go. Do we go with the ball? What's he going to do with it? Takes it to the corner post and then passes it to Hackney. Hackney then gives it to the R. Uh, straight in the goalie's hands. Uh, I hope this doesn't lead to their goal now. We were lucky there. Over a corner. Nicely held by our, whole, our goalie. Thrown out by Dewhurst to Oyano. Mola. Petrovic. Maldini. Hackney. What a ball. Great goal. Uh, I don't think it's going to count there. I think Dorigo was slightly offside. Here comes the ref to ruin it. Oh, okay. I stand corrected. I apologise. 1 0. And now third, which is realistically where we want to be. Uh, oh, back down to fourth now. Hearts have probably scored. All right, we'll take Hoyle off. He's not been playing well. Probably Ross Stewart up front. Uh, do that. Uh, who can we put on for Maldini? We'll put him on. We really could do with playing Hearts in one of the games leading up to the end of the season. Try and get a win over them. Hopefully then we can uh, get third place. I'd be buzzing if we get third place to be honest. Yeah, he is that. He, he watch Aberdeen equalise now in the last minute. Watch, here we go. I just, I just don't believe that at all. Look at that. Look at the stats. We were way better. Uh, and there's nothing we can do about it. Oh, so annoying. That we're now three points behind Hearts. And we're playing St Mirren next game. And if they beat us, they overtake us probably. So. Right, let's have a look at the recent form. It's not too bad. I don't think it's time to do a team meeting, is it? Should we do a team meeting? Encourage? Yeah, that backfired. Yeah, they're not happy with me. Oh, God, I made it worse. Uh, probably get rid of him. Is he worse? No, he's slightly better. Rangers beat Celtic, so that definitely doesn't help our chances of getting second place, but realistically we were never going to get second place. As soon as we lost the Rangers, I knew that wasn't going to happen. Fourth place, 
maybe third place now. Our expectations are getting lower and lower as the, as the games go on. Hopefully we can beat St Mirren. Fingers crossed. They have got Moolah though. Still can't believe St Mirren signed him. I don't know how they. I don't know how he. I don't know what made him decide to go to St Mirren of all places. He'd have thought he would have got offers in other clubs, better in hotter, nicer countries, or would have got more money, like in Saudi Arabia, for instance. Thomas Muller wanted to prove that he can uh, do it in the the best league in the world, in the Scottish Premiership. Right, St Mirren now. Must win game for us this one. Definitely must win game. Right, so we've got Duris in goal. We've got the usual defensive line. Foreigners actually is in centre defence. Rios is back in midfield. Carroza is on the right, bowler on the left. Maldini just behind Hoyland. Who are Hearts playing? Hearts are playing Celtic. Oh, that might help us. That might help us if, if we win. We've got to win first. Good defensive clearance there. Don't lose it. Oh. What are we playing at? Right, come on, let's get a goal. No messing around. We need to get a goal straight away. Yeah, come on. Oh, sorry. Penalty. Good. Hopefully. Yeah, he's going over there. Well, you, you know that usually means a penalty. Ooh. I can't do it that long. Hey, there we go. Right. Bowler, bloody score for the love of God. Don't miss. Yes, get in. Can we counter it? That's it. Can we get the ball? There we go. Let's get it. No, that's not where we want it to go. We don't want them in possession. We want this to be our highlight, not theirs. Come on. Ah, oh, there we go. No, again. What is it with our fullbacks today? All right, come on. Let's get a goal. Oh, unlucky. Right, there will be some substitutes in a, in, a, in a bit. Still only the first half, so. There we go. Go on, Maldini. Oh. Throw into us. Oh, Maldini, what are you doing? Maldini's coming off. That's the start off with. Good defending bowler. Get in. Right, Maldini, you're coming off. Deli Ali, you can come on. Oh. Okay. I don't know what happened here. 
we draw a penalty. Oh, no penalty. Ah, oh, that's just... That's never happened before. When it usually goes to the big screen, it's usually a bloody penalty every time. Hoyland, you need to come off because you're not doing very well. Diara, you need to come off and you're playing rubbish as well. How's Celtic doing? Celtic's drawing with hearts. Come on, Celtic, don't let us down. Then again, hearts getting a draw, and if we win, that'll help. If we lose, then uh, it's not good. Oh, jeez. Why do I open my big mouth? You watch Bloody Hearts will end up winning this now. Uh, at least Rangers are losing. Come on, Hackney. Come on, get the ball off them. No. Come on. Oh, come on. We're better than St. Mirren. Oh, I don't believe this. I don't believe this. <sighs> Why? We, might, we won't get top four now. I hate FM. I just hate playing it. I'll get another one now. Uh, I can't do a team meeting now after the game because I've already done it. That's what probably caused this in the first place. Oh, that couldn't have gone any worse if we tried. And I think, within, yeah, they they drew. So we're two points behind. We've got a game. Of, oh, no, that's sent me in, sorry. We're four points behind them now. So we're not going to probably get third place. We might get fourth place, but we probably won't. They haven't got a game for 10 days. Uh... No, I'll leave it. I think on that note, I'm going to leave it. I'm going to try and figure things out for the next episode. But yeah, thank you as always. Um, I'm sorry that this uh, episode 50 uh, didn't go very well. But I hope it was entertaining for you for all the wrong reasons. So yeah. Anyway, I'll be back tomorrow. Thanks again. All the best. Bye.